Hey guys, my name is Shazanae, and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of my stroller. My cat decided <laughs> this would be a really comfy place to sit while I do this, so hopefully there's not a lot of screws that <laughs> have to be put in here because I can't find a screwdriver. So, But I did bring the scissors to cut into this, so I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, let's just cut right into this. Now, my fiance was like, oh, you know, we should really wait to uh, put this together because the rooms aren't done or anything, but uh, I really didn't want to wait, so, yep, he's at work, so now I'm home doing this. <laughs> Ivy, you're going to have to move, Baba. You're going to have to move. All right, let's cut into this bad boy. This is probably the... Uh, unsafest way to open a box, but I'm poor and I can't afford an exacto knife. <laughs> They're about two dollars. Hold on a sec. Ivy, come on, Mama. Come on. You're gonna have to get down. You're gonna have to get... Okay, not on my camera. Okay, so <laughs> let's try to open this bad boy up. We actually had to order the stroller online because we had gone to Babies R Us and I really liked the stroller, but <clears throat> they were completely sold out in the store because uh, I guess it was a really popular stroller. And my mom bought the, uh, my grandmother bought this for me, and she was gonna give it to me on uh, my baby shower in two weeks, but it was really bulky, and she's like, "You might as well just bring it to your home now." Um, so I got like a unisex one because I'm planning on having more babies, so I didn't want to just get a pink one. But, um, okay, so I'm opening the box, <laughs> and I'm seeing a lot of cardboard at first. I really hope it's, like, already assembled. <laughs> so this will just be kind of an unboxing and not, like, an assembly thing. All right, it comes with the uh, tray. And what else? Let's see. looks like pretty much the bottom portion of the stroller. I'm really glad this is like all assembled already. <laughs> um, okay, so we'll look at that in a second. And then the other piece, ooh, I see wheels. I think those might come in handy. So these are, um, these are what the wheels, wheels look like. And then uh, I think this this um, stroller was about 200 and like maybe $70, but I think we got like almost $60 off. So it was a little over 200. Ooh, heavy. So this is, ah! Oh! Okay, so that's the actual seat she'll go in. So it's just more cardboard and then there's these things. Don't know what those are. We'll find out though. <laughs> Alright, so that is everything from the box. So let's move that over. And, uh, <clears throat> alright. <clears throat> let's try to figure out what everything is. This stroller actually turns into a car seat too. So this is pretty much a car seat. And I just got like a blue. Um, and then, let me see. Hmm. I'll show you when it's put together. But okay, so that's the car seat itself. So, all right, here's, okay, here's, I think, the instruction manual. Get any piece of plastic out of there. Let me go ahead and sit down for a second. <laughs> all right, um, that's a recall. Perfect. Uh, this looks like the instruction manual. Yes. So it's in English, I hope. Okay, so your child must be between the weight of 4 to 35 pounds, so it does go up to um like toddler, I think. Yeah. Uh, maybe not like toddler toddler, but a little while. <laughs> Alright, um, how do I put this together? Okay, I think this is what I needed. 
capacity. Okay, so I think this is it. So to open the stroller to begin with, and I think that's... <clears throat> oh, it has little uh, plastic zip ties attached to it. So let me just go ahead and take those off real quick. And then this little thing came off as soon as I cut that. So we'll put that aside so we don't lose it. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and cut this one off too. There we go. And, ooh! Okay. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so let me um, adjust my camera so maybe you can see what I'm doing. Okay, so this is a little better. Sorry, I'm moving you all around my living room. But, oop, that's not the right one. Okay, so this thing, to open up um, like the stroller part itself, it's kind of hard to show you on camera. Uh, <laughs> but let's see. <clears throat> it says fold and unfold strap located under this pocket. So it's showing me that there's a little, um, It's showing me that there's a little front pocket here. Okay, first of all, this thing is so complicated. Okay, so there's a little like lever here. Pull strap and pull up on handle as shown. Okay, so it's telling me to pull. Okay, it's doing something. Okay, hold on, let's try that. Okay. I just don't want to break it already. Okay. 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 I heard a click. Okay. It's standing up. It's doing something. Okay. Step one. <laughs> one, one done. Okay. Uh, <laughs> so that's how you would also fold it back down if you needed to. Okay. So step two. Okay, so once it snaps and it looks like this, we are on to step five. So the canopy, which is... Okay, how to adjust the camera again. You're getting farther and farther away. It's all good. So now the canopy... Um, <coughs> says insert canopy wire into the canopy mounts on each side of the stroller as seen. What the hell is a canopy wire? Is that that thing that this thing <sighs> what so these are the clips that it's supposed to go into but I don't understand oh oh okay so I just took these little things off and these little things are shown so okay I'm supposed to put these into the little clips on the side you'll see when I do the other side I can't really show you this side but Okay, so they just clip in just like that. So then you see right here this thing, probably kind of zoom in, but and then this little clip, all I did was slide it in until it snaps. And now we got this little, ooh. <laughs> so now we got the little canopy thing, okay. Okay, so the front wheel. Okay, so the front wheel is, um, this one with the two attached. The front wheel is this one with the two pieces attached. So it's saying, um, let's see, let's see. While holding the spring button down, so it's just this little gray, gray button. Okay, maybe not. Okay, definitely just one and then. And then snap it. Oop, snap it. Okay, the wheel's off. So, something was broken. I just basically, like, stuck my fingers in there and pushed this little lever out. Um, and then it snapped right in, and then I just... I don't know if that's broken or not, but it's definitely not coming off. So, okay, we got, we got the front wheel on, so... What's next? The rear wheels. Oh. Lovely. Let's turn this bad boy around. Scratching up my floor. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not mad. Okay. So basically, I got this little baggie with these weird looking... I don't even want to know what those are. And I got a couple of plasticky pieces. 
Um, so I'm assuming I'm going to need all that and probably, I don't know what that bar is for yet. Okay, so anyways, uh, rear wheels. Oh yeah, the bar is for this. Okay, so it's showing me to lie, lie this thing down. So I'm going to do that gently. Alright, let's see what it says. So it's saying, once I have it looking like this, it asks me to get these little pieces with this little lever thing on it and put it so they're facing this way. Yeah. It's telling me they should snap right into it. Let's see how... Okay, that was that was easy. I can do that. So these just snap right onto the pole. Okay. So these are brake levers. Okay. So then the next part is to take uh, this metal pole thing and put it through. Put it through the hole like this. Why is nothing ever easy? Okay. Okay. <laughs> so it went through, so it sticks out a little bit on each side. Okay. And then it's telling me to take the wheels and to take these weird looking things. I'm not really sure what those are. Uh, it's telling me to put... Okay. So this... This lines up with that, so that just slides onto that like that. So let me do that to the other wheel like that. And then it's telling me to take the wheel and it should go slide should slide right onto these poles. Oh, okay. So this is kind of hard to show. You're fucking kidding me. Okay. <laughs> So basically this thing, it has a little hole that will slide right into the pole and these little pegs catch something on these brakes. So if you were to apply the brakes that it would stop the wheel. So you can't, you cannot see it but basically it just slides in just like that. I'm gonna whoop, go ahead and do that to the other side as well. Then it's telling me to take these little pins and push straight side a pin through the axle, through the axle hole. Okay, okay, so on this little axle piece, which is that long metal piece, is a tiny little hole. So it's telling me to take these pins, and there are two of them. Ah, ah stuck in my tooth. <laughs> okay, it's telling me to take these little pins. Okay, and to slide these your straight edge, so it kind of looks like a wonky bobby pin. So there's a straight edge and then there's a curvy edge. So it's telling me to slide the straight edge through the hole so the curvy edge kind of goes over on top of the axle. Okay, okay, okay. I got it, I got it, I got it. <laughs> All right, it just wasn't fitting right at first, but it was because this little pin, hey, this little pin was kind of on the other side blocking, blocking any room. That makes any sense at all. Let me try to get this pin in. Finally, I got the fucking pins in. Okay, so <laughs> once you have the axle secure in place, the pins are in. Um, Next, it says, I don't even want to know what to do next. That was such a pain in the ass. It actually made me break out into it. Um, <laughs> it's telling me to just snap these little covers on, which I hope it's as easy as it sounds. It looks easy, but hell, I thought that was going to be, yeah, that was, that was easy. Okay, <laughs> we're, get, we're getting places. Okay. So these little covers just snap on like that. And I think the last thing is the tray. Yep, it's just the tray. Alright, so let's go ahead and make this right side up again. Where is this supposed to go? What are you doing? We'll figure that one out in a second. So, alright, here is 
here's a tray. So it's saying it should just snap right onto the front. We'll see how easy this one is too. So it looks like it should snap onto these little these little pieces right here. One on each side. Uh, looks like it would come up and slide on. Okay, so it just slides on. It just slides on. There we go. Uh, and then to open it. The fuck do you open it? To open the tray. My god, this is fucking rocket science, isn't it? How the shit do I open it? Open it! Okay, we'll figure out how to open the tray later. <laughs> Let's move on. Alright, so this is just the, uh, how to adjust, like, the seat belt in there, yada, yada, yada. We don't need to know that right now. And the brakes. How to change harness slots. Okay. Okay. Okay, so this is how to recline and to raise the seat. Um, so if you can kind of see that the seat is way back right now, and if I pull it up so she's actually sitting upright, um, then it shows me how to do that as well. So let's turn this bad boy around and try to figure, figure this out. Everything is so complicated. Ooh, extra storage space for my goodies. Okay, 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 we got a string, okay. <laughs> Alright, so these are just supposed to, oh, they just kind of scrunch together. Are you serious? It was that easy? It's just a little scrunchy thing, and it just, and if you want to recline it, you just pull it. Oh my god, technology these days is just fantastic. Okay, so that brings the seat up like that. Okay, so now, now that we have pretty much all the, um, components put together we're gonna see how it snaps back into place but if you guys oh, touching on to the cardboard if you guys can really see the stroller um, I don't know if you can really see the inside but it's just like a green leafy pattern and then the inside is just a nice blue um, like I said I got this stroller because it was good for both boy and girl but now it's saying to fold it and easily put it away which we're gonna have to do um, is to take that, there's a lever right under the seat, um, you really can't see that. Well, let's see, I'm going to stand up so I'll be out of the camera for a sec. But it's telling me, ooh, to pull it up, ooh, and it kind of folds down, down on itself, which it does, which I'm actually pretty damn excited about that something actually worked. Now I just got to figure out how to, um, open up a food tray, but now I will show you the car seat that it also comes with, which is this, and why is it so heavy? Okay, hold on, I'm a little congested with baby stuff right now. <laughs> so the car seat matches the, um, the stroller, it comes up, it has that little, what on earth, car seat has that little um, hooded thing again. This is the inside of it. Sorry, it's a little bit dark, but it's just so cute. So cute. Side impasse packing. I feel like this, does it even say anything about the stroller? I mean, the car seat. Okay, this is the one for the stroller. Uh, okay, so click connect. Um, Really, I just want to find out how to disconnect the bottom parts um, from the stroller so when I go to, you know, disconnect it from the bottom part of my stroller. Okay. Adam! 
god, oh my god. Okay, we'll figure it out off camera, but um, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick, well, I hope quick, um, unboxing and putting together of the stroller and the car seat. Um, again, I got this from Babies R Us. We had to order it online, but as stressed out as I look, I had fun doing this. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, please leave a like. It really helps me out. You can also subscribe if you don't want to miss any new videos. Also, my Twitter uh, channel link is on my channel page. And did I say channel link? Twitter link is on my channel page and my Instagram should be down below, which I will be posting a video very a picture very shortly of me doing this to let my followers know that this video is coming so that's a good way to keep up with me anyways thank you guys so much for watching I will see you next time bye